Asthma is a chronic respiratory condition that affects millions of people worldwide. It can manifest in varying degrees of severity and impacts the quality of life for those whom it affects. Therefore, early detection and intervention are crucial for managing this disease and reducing the risk of long-term complications, which is why we created this video to discuss the early warning signs of asthma and provide a comprehensive understanding of the subtle indicators that may point to this condition. Keep watching until the end because there are a few that most people aren't aware of. So if you're ready, let's get into it. The first early warning sign is wheezing. Wheezing is a high-pitched whistling sound that occurs when air flows through narrowed airways. This symptom is common in asthma due to inflammation and constriction of the bronchial tubes, making it difficult to breathe. Number two, persistent coughing. A persistent cough, especially one that worsens at night or during exercise, can be an early sign of asthma. This occurs as the body tries to clear excess mucus or irritants from the airways. Number three, chest tightness. Asthma sufferers often experience a feeling of tightness, pressure, or discomfort in the chest due to inflamed or constricted airways, which makes it harder for the lungs to fully expand. Next up is hypoxemia. Hypoxemia refers to low oxygen levels in the blood. In asthma, this can occur when the lungs struggle to transfer oxygen from inhaled air to the bloodstream due to airway obstruction or inflammation. Number five is tachycardia. Tachycardia is an abnormally rapid heart rate, which can result from the body's effort to compensate for reduced oxygen levels in the bloodstream due to an asthma attack. Another sign to look for is shortness of breath. Difficulty breathing or feeling out of breath, particularly during physical activity, is a common early warning sign of asthma. This happens due to the narrowing of the airways and increased mucus production, which is something I will discuss later on in this video. But number seven is cyanosis. Cyanosis is a bluish discoloration of the skin and mucous membranes, often seen around the lips and fingernail beds. This can occur in severe asthma cases when oxygen levels in the blood become critically low. Another sign is fatigue or general weakness. People with asthma may feel fatigued or weak due to the persistent struggle to breathe, which requires more energy and can lead to exhaustion. The next sign is rapid breathing. Rapid or shallow breathing can be a sign of asthma as the body tries to compensate for decreased airflow through the constricted airways. Number 10, difficulty sleeping. Asthma symptoms such as coughing, wheezing, and shortness of breath can worsen at night, making it difficult for individuals to sleep comfortably. This is known as nocturnal asthma and can be a significant indicator of the condition. Number 11, exercise intolerance. Asthma sufferers may experience difficulty engaging in physical activities or exercising, as it can exacerbate their symptoms. This is due to the increased demand for oxygen during physical exertion, which can lead to shortness of breath, wheezing, and coughing. The next sign on our list is increased mucus production. Inflammation in the airways can cause an overproduction of mucus, leading to increased phlegm or congestion. This excess mucus can further obstruct the airways, exacerbating asthma symptoms. Number 13, frequent upper respiratory tract infections. People with asthma are often more susceptible to upper respiratory infections, such as colds or sinusitis, due to their inflamed and sensitive airways. These infections can worsen asthma symptoms or even trigger asthma attacks. Number 14, Difficulty speaking due to a lack of air. During an asthma attack or severe shortness of breath, individuals may find it difficult to speak or complete sentences as they struggle to catch their breath, making communication challenging. The next sign to look for is a pale, sweaty face. During an asthma attack or periods of labored breathing, the face may become pale and sweaty due to reduced oxygen levels and increased physical exertion required to breathe, which leads to number 16, 
feelings of anxiety and panic. The struggle to breathe during an asthma episode can induce feelings of anxiety or panic as individuals may feel overwhelmed and fearful of their breathing difficulties, which may also lead to feelings of confusion. A lack of oxygen in the bloodstream can cause feelings of confusion or disorientation, especially during a severe asthma attack. This mental fog can make it difficult for individuals with this condition to think clearly or make decisions. Number 18. Itching of the chin or neck. Asthma can sometimes be accompanied by an itching sensation around the chin or neck, which may be a result of irritation or a subtle indication of respiratory distress. Number 19. Nasal congestion. Inflammation in the upper respiratory tract can lead to nasal congestion, which can further contribute to breathing difficulties in individuals with asthma. Another sign to look for is a sore throat. Persistent coughing, increased mucus production, and the use of certain asthma medications can cause a sore throat, which may be an early warning sign of asthma or an indicator of worsening symptoms. Number 21, clammy skin. During an asthma attack or when experiencing breathing difficulties, the skin may become cool and clammy due to the body's increased effort to breathe and its attempt to regulate temperature. Number 22 is posture changes. Individuals with asthma may unconsciously change their posture to facilitate easier breathing, such as leaning forward, hunching their shoulders, or raising their chin to open up the airways. Another important sign to look for is a decrease in peak flow reading. A peak flow meter is a device used to measure lung function, specifically the maximum airflow during a forceful exhalation. Therefore, a decrease in this measurement indicates worsening airflow and reduced lung function. The next sign on our list is restlessness. Difficulty breathing or discomfort associated with asthma symptoms can lead to restlessness, making it challenging for individuals to relax or find a comfortable position. Number 25, dizziness. Reduced oxygen levels in the blood due to asthma-related breathing difficulties can cause dizziness, lightheadedness, or even fainting in severe cases. It can also result in changes in speech patterns. Struggling to breathe can affect a person's speaking patterns, making their speech hurried, broken, or shallow as they try to catch their breaths between words. Number 27, dry mouth. Mouth breathing, which is common during asthma flare-ups or attacks, can lead to dry mouth as their air dries the oral cavity, potentially causing discomfort or irritation. Number 28, dark bags under your eyes. Chronic sleep disturbances, such as those caused by nocturnal asthma symptoms, can lead to dark bags or circles under the eyes due to fatigue and lack of restorative sleep. And another obvious sign of asthma is the increased need for inhaler use. An increased reliance on quick relief inhalers, such as bronchodilators, can signal worsening asthma control or an escalation in symptoms. So as you can see, the early warning signs of asthma should not be ignored or dismissed. Effectively treating and managing asthma symptoms requires a comprehensive approach that involves medication, lifestyle changes, and regular monitoring. By paying close attention to these subtle symptoms, such as frequent coughing, shortness of breath, chest tightness, and wheezing, you can take the necessary steps toward proper diagnosis and treatment. Identifying asthma at its earliest stages not only ensures a better quality of life for those affected, but also helps reduce the risk of severe exacerbations and long-term complications. As asthma remains a prevalent health issue worldwide, raising awareness about these early indicators is critical in promoting timely intervention and ultimately improving the lives of those living with this chronic condition. If you want to support the channel, please like and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it. And there should be some other helpful videos popping up on your screen right about now that I think you will enjoy. And just a quick reminder, we are not doctors. This video is for informational purposes only. Thank you so much for watching. Have a blessed day. And as always, breathe easy, my friend.